Well, it's, it, this is a change. The NC2A has opened up what they are calling early signing. Yeah. It's an early 72-hour period before the big signing in February when all the mostly uh, high school football players make their decisions known. They wanted to keep schools from poaching other kids by allowing the kids who have verbally committed to make it official in a 72-hour window they are calling early signing period. Two of those kids are joining me now from Mission Hills. We will go there where I see Jack Tuttle and I see Sam Dixon. Gentlemen, can you hear me? Yes, sir. All right, well, Mr. Tuttle, we will start with you. Eight days ago, your life changed forever. We're looking at some video of you accepting the 2017 Silver Pigskin Trophy. How has your life changed? <laughs> um, well, um, I try and uh, stay humble and keep my head down, but um, it was truly an honor to win that award, and uh, I appreciate it. Um, all the voters and I uh, appreciate PPR for that so thank you. Yeah you're you're a member of a very exclusive club uh, since uh, day one even though before this trophy was put in uh, by the way it's at the uh, jewelers right now they are having some problems with the diamond inlay and they said they'll have it in your possession by the end of the year so we look forward to that uh, uh, arrival at your homestead but right now uh, we've known since day one since the get-go that you're gonna be a Ute what do you like about Utah so much? Uh, what attracted you to that campus? Um, well, it was a relationship established upon trust. Um, the academics are superb. Um, the culture there is amazing, and um, the campus is truly beautiful. So uh, I could go on and on, but those are some of the things that I really love about that place. All right, we'll get back to you in a moment. Sam, uh, you're a two... Uh, you're a two-sport or two-way player. Uh, we have a lot of video of you carrying the ball from Mission Hills, getting it from Tuttle. Uh, what side of the ball does the Naval Academy have in store for you? I'm committed to play a uh, running back at the Naval Academy. How cool is that? Talk a little bit about uh, your running style and how it's going to fit into the to the Naval Academy's attack. Well, I think I'll fit into the Naval Academy running style because I'm a I'm a downhill hard powerful back. I agree with that. Uh, we have video of Annapolis. Uh, it's a very special place that requires a special commitment. Can you tell us about your first steps there and, and how it affected you? Oh, it's just beautiful. The place looks like a palace. There's tradition everywhere you go and I'm just blessed to be able to step foot on the campus. Did you, were you in attendance of the uh, recent Snow Bowl? Were you there for that? No, I was not. I went to the uh, game against SMU. Very cool, very cool. Um, uh, you, you know, we, I know of at least two other San Diegans that are going to be joining you at the Naval Academy. Have you met Iron Hog winner Nick Del Delacqua? And uh, are, 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 will you have uh, comfort and company that you know? Yes, sir. I'm, I'm good friends with Nick Delacqua and Tajon. We, uh, we've spent some time together and we're very familiar with each other. And we took our official visits together. It's very cool. So it helps to know somebody that's good, uh, that has San Diego ties. Before I let you go, I, I want to ask you both this question. Uh, Jack, this new signing period, uh, are you uh, obviously you're a fan of it because you took advantage of it, right? Uh, yes, sir. Explain why I'm, it's good. Uh, I guess I'll go ahead. No, explain why it's a good thing. Um, I, I guess uh, it's a good thing for, for us who know um, that's where we really want to go so we can get a, a sign, on, sign on the dotted line, uh, make it a done deal. So um, we're very fortunate to be in this position, and uh, uh, we love our universities we're going to. So. And, and before, Jack, before I let you go, uh, did any other schools try to get in on you late, even after you made your Utah verbal commitment? Um, yeah, some, but, I mean, it, it didn't really... Um, didn't really affect uh, my family and I's decision. We kind of um, stuck with our decision, and we knew it, th was, it was the right choice. So that speaks to you, the character, and the adults in your life, man. I, 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 any kid who can honor a commitment like that is cool. Sam, uh, same thing to you. Uh, did anybody try to shake you from your naval commitment, or when you commit to Navy, is that is that a bond that's impossible to break? Yeah, no one really tried to sway me after I committed to Navy. There was no way I was gonna go anywhere. No other school could give me the same benefits that the Naval Academy could. Uh, gentlemen, thank you. I know you have to get to class. Uh, we appreciate your time. Just a quick uh, word to all. Our, uh, uh, Jack, I'll be seeing you soon with the trophy. So uh, go to class, guys. Thank you for spending time with us.
Uh, just a quick uh, <laughs> thank you, thank graphic. you very much. All right, guys, a uh, quick graphic. We have more coming your way. A pair of hornets are going to be coming in in the 8:30 hour, and we're also going to have Greg Bell, who is the most sought-after JUCO running back in the nation. We don't know where. We have about 27 hats in Sports Row. We don't know which one he's going to put on, so that's going to be a big announcement at wow. 945. But we know of about 15 kids yeah. who are taking advantage of this early signing period. That's Guess awesome. how many cameras we have out? 15. That's a good guess. So wow. we're going to be everywhere in the county. And you know what I have to say about Jack, because he ha was here in studio last week, yeah. right after he won the, the Silver Pigskin. So impressive, that kid and his family. And he is going to leave Mission Hills. He's going to Utah in January. He's going to start classes I know. in so January. His high school career is over. And I'll tell you what, uh, let's not overlook Sam. Any oh, yeah, anybody, absolutely. Anybody who makes an academy commitment is not only making a commitment for school, but they're but also making a to commitment. To this country. And, and, yeah. And to that, uh, we're gonna see, I hold those kids in the highest. We're going to see a lot of highlights on both of them I come Saturday. So. I hope so, and we wish them both well. And we, you know, just class action. And not many, not yeah. many high school seniors can pull off a bow tie either. Yeah, yeah. especially yeah. at right. seven I mean, o'clock in the only morning. Dave My Scott goodness. can do that, right? <laughs> right? All right, Paul. Thank you. you bet. Thanks, Paul. We'll be right back with more of Good Morning San Diego right after this.